Good morning. God bless your heart real good. Once again, this is the servant of Jesus Christ, Robert Dunlap, coming to you one more time, representing Jesus. God the Father sent his son, Jesus Christ, to the earth. I said, God the Father sent Jesus. No, God the Father didn't come down here, but he sent Jesus. To die for our sin, to take away our sin, uh, to take away our sin, uh, to take away, take away, you know the sin you say you got, we all got, you know the sin you say you were born with, to take away, to take away, you know you you say you ain't perfect, to take away our sin, take it away, he came to take it away, and then through his blood, hallelujah. Let's get right, let's get right to it, hallelujah. I'm going to get ready to go take my morning walk. <coughs> let's get right to it. And we got something that's coming later on. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Later on, we got a God with it. We got, it's all, the message already recorded. We're going to deal with some of you ignorant preachers' theology. You know you add your theology to the Bible. On that note, you know you add your theology to the Bible. The Bible, is, you don't believe the Bible. People even go somewhere to tell you to tell you you can't believe the Bible. Tell you you can't take the Bible literally. So I pull take your word. You do know you say you can't take God's word. And Jesus' word, literally. You know that, right? Then you make yourself a fool. Well, the Bible say, uh, if your eye fit, you plug it out. The Bible say, eat my flesh and drink my blood. Yeah, you ignorant thing, you. You're just as ignorant and dumb. Jesus didn't tell you to pluck your eye out. And Jesus didn't tell you to eat your flesh and drink your blood. Read what else it said. In the same passage. What did he mean? Oh, it's in the same passage of scripture. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. Woo. Anyway, let's go right to what <coughs> I was told Hallelujah. Last weekend, had a church of God in Christ the elder called me. He hadn't heard from me in a while. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. So he called me. And I, get, I, I, I guess he thought that he was going to give a sermon to me. So I let him rattle on. I, I ain't paying him no attention. I've been holding. I got the phone sit down on speaker. He did rattling on and rattling on and you know, giving his commentary, his thoughts, and his views, and hallelujah, praise God, and everything. After a while, I called his name. And I had him to read the scripture. And in the scripture, I say, you are antichrist. You are antichrist, but Let's skip. When the scripture got through, he read for himself. He repented. And he agreed with the scripture. But before then, in our discourse, and I, I invite any of you, contact me. Contact me. Got one rule. This is right. This, this is right. It's what this said. Not to a pastor, not to a bishop, not to an apostle, not to God Christ, nobody else. What this said. So, uh, God, hallelujah. God bless his heart. He said, you need to be careful. Call, be careful. Call the both Antichrist now. Be careful. 
Now, some folks do things in ignorance they don't know no better, which is the condition of most people in the holiness church. Church of God in Christ. Baptist, Methodist, whatever. Most are, most are ignorant. But the moment you hear the word of God, you are no longer ignorant. You ain't got to go on no fast. Jesus mean what he said. Jesus even said, he that believeth on me as the scripture have said. He didn't say pray for understand. He said, believe on me as the scripture have said. Jesus said, keep my saying. He didn't say pray about my saying. He said, keep it. So you don't like what he say, so you're going to pray that he changed it. He ain't going to change his word. Jesus said, my word shall stand forever. Oh, then what, what? Be careful, call him. You need to be careful, call him all that. Right? No, once you know better. And God knows you've been little, God knows you've been little, watching me in it, and you didn't know me personally. Off internet. The, the, the 672 South Lauderdale. The mother church. I, God, you know. Hallelujah. <laughs> Praise God. You, you shall know from the past on down. We give no regard to nobody. Praise God. You know. Mm -hmm. My family know it. Everything connected to me. No. Talk about everything connected to me. Be blessed. No, everything connected to me. Know the word of God. They're going to hear the word of God. Praise God. <laughs> Hallelujah. Now, what he said, be careful calling on the Antichrist. He had some more on, on someone on YouTube. You, you call it all these folks fall probably. Yeah, of course you are. Now, if you don't know it, the word of God coming, you ain't good. you continue to preach wrong. You are Antichrist. Well, the Antichrist ain't got here yet. Who told you that? The beast haven't got here yet. And the second beast. They haven't got here yet. You know, that's the head. They'll be the head. The devil. They haven't got here yet. But Antichrist is here now. And he your power. Let, go, let it go right and show that. Go to first John. Let's show this. Hallelujah. I want you to go to first John. Antichrist among us now. Give me first John chapter two. Praise our God. <clears throat> oh. Matter of fact, let me put this back in the freezer with this water. Want to get a little more chill. Praise the Lord. Get your Bible and go to First John chapter 2. My God, that I say once you hear the word, oh, it's too late. Yeah, it's too late. <laughs> ha. If you speak anything contrary to the doctrine, if you speak anything contrary to Jesus, and you know it, you are antichrist and you are a false prophet. Go to 1 John chapter 2 and verse 18. First John 2 18. Listen, listen, you may be at it, right? No, you ain't got to worry about those electric fish being on Antichrist. Uh, look up in that pool pit. Although they eat you, electric fish is evil. Yeah, Trump eat you up, but look at the pool pit. 
In verse yeah, chapter 2 and verse 18, read with me so you won't be antichrist. Little children, it is the last time as ye have heard that antichrist shall come. You heard they come. You know, the, 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 the beast is going to oppose God. Everything about God, he's going to oppose. Don't you know when you speak a trade to the scripture, you oppose God, you hypocrite, you, you don't know that? Even now are there many antichrists right now. Whereby we know this is the last time. Where the Antichrist said, they went out from us, among us, and they went out from us. <coughs> we preach the gospel of Jesus Christ. We preach the righteousness through Jesus Christ. We preach that Jesus Christ came from heaven. <coughs> God sent his son Jesus into the world. He came from the Father. They went out from us. Antichrist was among us and still among us. Some went out. But they were but they were not of us. Well, you ain't of us. For if they had been of us, they would no doubt have continued with us. You had to cry. You did. You in the church of God in Christ that deleted me from your page when I spoke out against the false prophets and Antichrist in your so-called holy convocation. You had to cry. You went out from me, and you wanted the world to know I'm not of it. You did delete me on Facebook, and you still see me. You don't think I know that? And you watched it on YouTube. You deleted me, you had to cry. You had to cry. They went out. They went out from us. But they were not of us. But if they had been of us, they would know that had continued with us. But they went out that they might be made manifest. They were not all of us. Antichrist. Antichrist wanted to make it known. I'm not with him. <laughs> but ye have an option. Watch it. From the Holy One, you know all things. I have not written on you because you not know not the truth. But because ye know it, and no lie is of the truth. Who is a liar that denies Jesus is the Christ? No, you say Jesus is God. You are a liar, and you are Antichrist. He is Antichrist. No, not Antichrist, not the beast coming. That denied the Father and the Son. You denied both of them. Whosoever denied the Son, the same have not the Father. You are Antichrist. You deny that the Father sent the Son into the world. But he did not, the, 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 the Son had the Father also. <coughs> Watch it. Stay in front of Hallelujah, God. Oh. Uh, Prince John chapter. Four. And verse one. Beloved. Believe not every spirit, but try to spirit with the of God because many false prophets are going out into the world. False prophet and antichrist is the same thing. You didn't know that? Let's show it. You didn't know false prophet and antichrist the same thing. Hereby know we the spirit of God. Every spirit that confess that Jesus is coming in the flesh is of God. You don't say Jesus coming in the flesh. You say God took part of himself off. You say God himself. To left his throne and came down and got the body. You say Jesus is God. Jesus is the Father. 
Some ignorant say Jesus sent himself. I mean, God sent his own self. Pray John chapter 4, verse 2. It, Hereby know ye the Spirit of God. Every Spirit they confess that Jesus Christ is coming to the flesh of God. Every Spirit they confess not that Jesus is coming to the flesh of the Lord of God. And this is that Spirit of Antichrist. Whereof you heard that it shall come, even now is it already in the world. Ye are God living children that have overcome them because great is he that is in you that he is in the world. Who in the world? Antichrist, false prophet. <clears throat> Every spirit, back to verse 3, Every spirit they confess, not that Jesus did come in the flesh of not God. You said Jesus did come. We go back to Hebrew chapter 7, the tie, you tie the offering, the Levitical priesthood. And we showed it to the, to the elder. He was blind and dumb. Talk about he read the whole Bible. I asked him about this. He said, I, I, I read the whole Bible. Everybody asked you about that. That, that, don't, that don't deter us. Go to Hebrew chapter 6. Remember, every spirit that confess <laughs> not that Jesus coming in the flesh. Go to the 7th chapter of Hebrew. Verse 11. Did this with the tithing off of you, Antichrist, you. Any of you say God required tithing off of you, saying Jesus didn't come. You are Antichrist. Hebrew 7 11. If therefore perfection were up by the Levitical priesthood, for under it the people received the law, what for the need was there? That another priest should rise after the order of Melchizedek and not call after the order of Abraham. For the priesthood being changed, there is made a necessity to change the law. For he whom these things spoke of saying none pertain to another tribe. Quit no man get with ten at the altar. Hey, Jesus ain't at the altar take no tithes and offering. Antichrist here. I think he's scripture. Uh-huh. Well, is that what did that our Lord sprang out of Jew? You said Jesus didn't come. God to require tithes and offering. You are Antichrist. You said Jesus didn't come. All right. All right. Mm -hmm. see, see that? See that? Go back for it, John, and we're going to knock off it. I'm going to take my walk. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hope to God. Go back for it, John. You deny Jesus came. <coughs> All right. Chapter 4, 1 John, chapter 4, verse 9. And this was manifest the love of God toward us because that God sent his only begotten son. God didn't come down here. He sent his son. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at verse 14. And we have seen and do testify that the father sent the son to be the savior of the world. Uh -huh. All right. Chapter 5 and verse 11. And this is the record that God has given us eternal life, and this life is in his son. Verse 9. If we receive the witness of men, the witness of God is great, for this is the witness of God, which he testified of his son. Alright. Antichrist. Oh, Antichrist is here. And he and or she or it is your pastor. Antichrist is here. Now don't you be an Antichrist. Don't you say nothing contrary to the doctor. Don't say nothing. You didn't know she you didn't know false prophet antichrist the same thing. False prophet teach contrary to Jesus. And the Antichrist, he could trade to Jesus. 
They want in the same. We just read it. All right, that's enough. God bless you. Thank you for being